Number 51. Pressure cookers increase cooking speed by raising the boiling temperature of water above its value at atmospheric pressure. Letter A. What pressure is necessary to raise the boiling point to 120 degrees Celsius? All right. So in order to understand this, we just have to understand vapor pressure. Now, the idea I'm going to tell you is that the actual uh, idea behind it is a little more complicated, but we can think about it simply as this, that the uh, vapor pressure is the pressure at which uh, water will boil given its temperature. All right. So for example, if you were, let's say at a high altitude, now, you know, pressure drops the higher you go. Okay, so let's say you are at a very, very high altitude and the atmospheric pressure is now lower than true atmospheric pressure. All right, so we have the, well, not true atmospheric, but I mean, it is the true atmospheric pressure, I should say, lower than sea level atmospheric pressure. Okay, we have this value in the table down here. Take a look at the bottom. The words, uh, the numbers might be a little small, but this right here is atmospheric uh, pressure at sea level. The higher you go in altitude, right, the lower the pressure, the atmospheric pressure becomes. So now notice that as we go higher in altitude, the pressure would have gone down, but also what happens then to the boiling point of water now? The boiling point of water would have gone down to 95 degrees Celsius. We know that normally water boils at 100 degrees Celsius, right? Well, that's only true if we're under sea level, roughly sea level conditions here. But, and so as you go up in altitude or change your altitude, you know the pressure changes and then the temperature of the, uh, the temperature at which water will boil will also change. Now, here's the thing. This is why sometimes when you cook or cooking recipes, depending upon where you live, might change. If you're at higher altitude, you probably have to cook your food longer, all right, than at lower altitudes. The reason why is because the water will boil at a lower temperature at higher altitudes than as when compared to sea level, all right? I know the problem doesn't talk anything about, you know, altitudes and stuff, but I think that concept might be familiar to some people. So here's the thing. Pressure cookers do the exact opposite. They're like going deeper, so to speak, into the Earth's crust, right? We're going to increase the pressure now. So now we want water to boil at 120 degrees Celsius, and what must the pressure be? Overall, absolute pressure, the absolute pressure of... of the uh, air has to be now 1.99 times 10 to the fifth Pascal. So in order for water to boil at 120 degrees Celsius, the absolute pressure over that water must be 1.99 times 10 to the fifth, times 10 to the fifth Pascals. So that's the answer, all right? It's simply looked up in the table. But then for letter B now, what does it say? What gauge pressure does this correspond to? So you remember the formula gauge pressure is equal to absolute pressure minus then 1.013 times 10 to the fifth Pascals. So you just plug in this value into the absolute pressure to solve, right? Gauge pressure would then be 1.99 times 10, oops, times 10 to the fifth minus then 1.013 times 10 to the fifth. And what do we get? Let's see. 1.99 times 10 to the fifth minus 1.013 times 10 to the fifth. And we get about 9.77, 9.77 times 10 raised to now the fourth Pascal. And this is now what the gauge pressure or the ga a gauge would read on the pressure cooker. All right, so basically the pressure, the added amount of pressure that the pressure cooker has to add, well, I guess that's kind of right redundant, um, but the amount of pressure that the pressure cooker has to add is going to be equal to this amount of pressure, all right, over that of the atmospheric pressure. In order for the oil, water to boil, I think, what was that, a combination of water and boil? I'm not really sure, but that's the additional pressure necessary to boil water then at 120 degrees Celsius. The higher the boiling point, that means then the higher the cooking temperature, basically. All right, the, the higher the uh, temperature of the water is allowed to get before it boils. Anyway, all right, guys, thanks for tuning in. Hopefully this helped. Please remember, subscribe. See you next time.